Verizon is throttling your streaming. Don't believe me? Watch this video, and I will prove it to you, and I will also show you how you can fight back. First, I'm going to show you my unthrottled download speed using speedtest.net. Do you use Android or iPhone? Write down in the comments section which one you are using. As you can see, I'm getting over 35 megabits per second of download speed. Now we will do the same test using Fast.com, which is powered by Netflix. As you can see, we got less than 3.5 megabits per second in that test. To verify the results of the test, we will run it once more. As you can see, we finished just slightly higher at 3.8 megabits per second. This test right here proves that Verizon is throttling our streaming. This is actually not surprising. When you look at the terms of the Verizon Unlimited plans, you will find that most of them say something along the lines of video streams at 480p. Well, this is generally not going to cause any major headaches, there is a simple technique we can use to bypass the throttling altogether. For this, we are going to use a VPN service. You can use whatever VPN service you would like. For this example, I will be using ExpressVPN. From here, we simply want to connect to the server that is closest to our location. Now that our VPN is successfully connected, we will rerun the Netflix speed test. I am now getting nearly 10 times the speed I was getting before without the VPN. I will run the test one more time. As you can see, our download speed is now nearly identical to the unthrottled speeds we are getting to speedtest.net. Just to verify the result, we will disconnect our VPN and we will run the test one more time. With the VPN disconnected, our speeds once again are being throttled to sub 4 megabits per second. If you're sick of being throttled, please consider dropping a like on this video.